back to another week's vlog. Sophie here checking in, huh? Just kidding. <laughs> Feeling this little head wrap I got going, hmm? I thought I'd try something different. We're trying, still trying to prepare for my graduation party. So yeah, y'all saw that um, we were gonna have it in a building, but we've changed our mind for other reasons. So we're gonna have it at the house. Just joking, just not kidding. But yeah, we're gonna have it at the house, which I'm not the most excited about, but we're we're gonna make it look really nice, you know. My mom, she just says my your mom is in the house. Like, yes, I am. We're doing it together. She wants me to tell y'all that she's giving me this party, but we're having it together. Like, I'm obviously helping. So yeah, we're pretty. I'm pretty excited because I think it's gonna be really cool. So right now we're at Michael's, and we're gonna hit up Dollar Tree and see what they have to find. Little decorations, things we can make all that kinds of jazz because me my sister and my mom were all pretty creative people and I like making stuff anyway so yeah right now they have these at Michael's I don't think we need these right now but so guys here's a lot of little because I want to have a dessert a a dessert station so here are a lot of these cute containers which we've already been accumulating some over the past couple of weeks but this is kind of nice it's cute I really like this one here really nice and we also already have four or three of these so we're set for those those would be cute I'm gonna show my mom because I want to show her the price difference here they go a whole bunch these are like 20 bucks and then this one that I got from Goodwill remember I got this mm -hmm. I paid what six dollars this is like 24 bucks here That's good to go mom look at these look at these and we already have them. Look how much they are. 15. That's not that bad. 24. That's plastic. And we have all this stuff. Hey, I just want to show you guys. If anybody else is watching this, whether you're wealthy or you poor or you in between, y'all can literally save so much money, which is why, which is I'm actually thankful that my mom gave me this tip in life. Like all these containers that I just showed y'all are like $24. We've already gotten them from Goodwill and Dirt Cheap and they're the exact same. All you have to do is literally wash them and we got them for like $6. So you can save money all kinds of ways and still make your stuff look nice, classy and neat, you know? Hey guys, so I'm back home. Um, excuse my hair, I'm about to do it right now. So me and my mom have been out all day looking, just collecting stuff for my graduation party. Now I am about to do a hot oil treatment on my hair, um, just cause I have been neglecting my hair so much. Literally, I just put on um, a hat or just slick it back like a middle part bun and just head out cause I'm going to be using, um, first off, the Shea Moisture Strengthen and Restore Hair Serum, which is just a bunch of oils mixed together. Shea butter and peppermint, which and peppermint helps stimulate the scalp. Jojoba oil in it. And then I'm also going to add this Shea Moisture Rehydration Coconut Oil in it too. So I'm about to put that in this bowl and then put it on some boiling water that I have downstairs and put that on my hair. And while that's on my hair, I'm actually going to, um... Finish. I was cleaning my room yesterday, which it, I cleaned the rest. It's just this, which is all clothes. I need to put all those clothes up. Then I'm going to hop in the shower. Yeah, I think I'm going to do a twist out on my hair. So, yeah. Y'all, I don't know if y'all watch Housewives of Atlanta, but I do a new season premieres tonight, and I'm excited. I've been waiting on it. So, yeah, I'll check back in probably with you guys when my hair is all twisted up. All right guys, I look a little crazy, but I have put the hot oil in my hair and hot towel over it. Now I have on the Aztec Indian clay mask. As you can see, it's a little tight. And I'm about to hop in the shower and just finish kind of whatever, um, which is what I like to do on Sundays. Just kind of get myself ready for the week. And yeah, so after I got the shower, obviously I'm gonna do my little twist out or whatever. 
and um, I will probably see you guys tomorrow so yeah hey guys today is Monday I just got out of class and headed to the gym now but I kind of wanted to come on here and just talk a little bit about it whatever so if y'all don't know whatever whatever thanks for watching my channel I'm Sophie B. Um, so I'm a college student and I'm about to graduate in December with my bachelor's degree and tomorrow I give my final it's like a it's called a communication exit assessment so basically I have to do an interview in front of a panel and basically talk about my college journey what I plan to do after school how my degree is going to help me whatever so it's a major deal because whether you pass all your classes or not if you um, if the panel feels like you did bad they can literally tell you okay you're not graduating so it's kind of a big deal but I'm not really too pressed about it but I don't know um, one of my teachers she's actually gonna be on the panel she was just kind of giving me a little heads up of kind of some things to look forward to tomorrow I feel some kind of way I don't know if it's because like this is like it like this is like the end and y'all don't get me wrong child. I'm ready to go I'm tired of school but it's kind of like bittersweet because it's like okay you're not gonna let me over you're a loser Susie I guess I like I've been in school for so long it's like now I guess it's time to be in the real world I don't know it's it's like anxiety because you don't have school as an excuse like for so long you know people ask or whatever oh what do you do oh I'm a student at blah 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 now I don't know it's like all these societal pressures and it's anxiety is built up to a whole nother level I feel it in my chest like uh, I don't, it's just so much like what do I do now even though I have like a goal and ideas in mind that I want to do it's still like I don't know y'all it's stress my eyes starting to get watery y'all I gotta go it's like wow like I'm really growing up I know that's so like uh, corny to say but once you graduate college like you like really growing up like I'm 23 hello uh, what's next hey guys um, it is Tuesday morning as y'all know from yesterday's clip I'm giving my final exit assessment presentation today and I just thought I would come on camera and take these twists out um on camera so i'm not nervous um i just got done making some flashcards to keep me you know afloat so everything flows smoothly it's 218 my presentation is at three i really need to hurry up for real All right, guys, since I'm about to head out to do my presentation, this is what I'm wearing. We had to be professional. Obviously, we're giving a presentation. So I thought I'd show you guys what I'm wearing. And wish me luck. Because if they say no, then I won't be graduating. Yeah. Okay, guys, so I'm in the bathroom. I just got done doing my presentation. They passed me, so that means I'm graduating. Yay. Thank God. And they said I did a really good job and they like my skills and all that kind of stuff. So, yay! This is one level of stress that is taken off of me because y'all know I be stressed out. But yeah, y'all should follow me on Snapchat at SophieJ445. I'm excited. Hey guys, so today is Friday and today we are having a senior toast. So, I guess we just kind of toast to our commencement or whatever so we have to dress up and all that stuff is at 12 30 so i thought i would come on camera and do my makeup i already did my eyebrows i got my edges baking so yeah i just thought i would kind of you know what i'm saying Thanks, bud. Okay guys, so this is what I am wearing. So we have to dress like businessy or whatever. I look like I'm about to report the news, <laughs> which is, I did a red lip because it's tiny red lines in the dress. So the red lip 
brings it out um but this is the dilemma because right now it's 58 degrees outside and we are going to be outside i mean these little booties i don't know what y'all thinking these and these this is the outfit with these shoes on um what do y'all think oh i don't know ain't nobody even here to help me so i need to go so this is the makeup that i did um and I wanted to do a bun with my hair, but I also didn't want to mess up my hair because I slick just did it. So, yeah. So, I guess I will see you guys when I get there. Show y'all what's going on. Hey, guys. Hi. Hey, Andrea. Hi. So, we have class together. But, um, yeah, we're graduating together and we're here at the Senior Toast or whatever. We just took pictures. Cheers, huh? huh? Cheers. Um, so, that was pretty fast. So, now she's about to get a few pics of me. I took some of her. And I guess that's it. This was real fast. I guess we get to keep these glasses. Mm -hmm. I hope I do. guess. Okay. This is pretty good. Would I wait hours in the line for it? No. Bessa. <laughs> no. Okay, guys. So, y'all know I've been trying to lose weight or whatever. Just disregard that just for this little 30 minutes. Y'all, yeah. I haven't tried the Popeye's chicken sandwich because now... Um, y'all know they were out, so they just got them back. So me, oh, this is my friend Eddie. He's about to start hey. YouTube. Too. <laughs> Eddie, you just start every day. You already know what's going on. Gang, gang. I don't like hot food, but he said you have to get spicy to really get that flavor. Cause so the I other one, spicy. it just like the classic. I don't, know, I don't, I don't, I don't understand the hype. It just right. tastes like the Popeye's pie. Oh, I'm, I'm just kind of taking the sandwich apart, looking at it, and my friend said the pickles are more crispy than Chick-fil-A, and the pickles, look, they are like crispy, like whole cucumbers. In a good way, you know what I'm saying? Because cucumbers is pickles. Yeah, but here. they're like not, like Chick-fil-A, they be soggy. Same. This is a big piece of chicken, child. Yeah, I get that palate cleansed. One, two, Like it's spicy. So guys, my verdict, Sorry. it's definitely good. Like I would definitely get it again. Mm -hmm. But I don't I don't see the the cause for the hype. It's not like everybody just kind of ride the wave. You know? Right. Chick-fil-A is like the parent who cares for your health, and then Popeyes is like the grandma who be cooking with fat backs and bacon bits. I'm done. Yeah, it's like the same thing, but it's Two levels. <laughs> and then I saw this other meme where it was like this little scrawny chicken um, and it had black stuff on it, smoking a blunt, and that was like Popeyes. And then it had like a healthy looking chicken holding the Bible. <laughs> that was like that Chick fil A. That right. was like, y'all, I'm y'all too much. But this is definitely way more crispy and crunchy than um, Chick fil A. So, a little quick backstory on me and Eddie. Not a backstory, but so we've known each other since high school now college we're actually about to graduate college together we both graduate december 14th okay. from csu whoa, whoa.